Oh well, guys, as soon as I know, I'm gonna let you guys know because I'm gonna get back on. I'm gonna get back on here tomorrow. Y'all, I don't know what I pulled in my stomach. Oh my god. Excuse me. I gotta say, oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm trying to speak better. Um, yeah. Stomach's been giving me problems all day. Um, but what was I saying? Oh, yeah. So a lot of you that are new, that are asking me what I'm doing tomorrow. Y'all must have just came in. Y'all just came in. <laughs> Is it Charlie Horse in my stomach? I thought Charlie Horses were like... I don't know. <laughs> Shoot, never mind. Maybe it isn't Charlie. I don't, I don't know. But in my stomach... Thank you. Um, <laughs> Endometriosis, did it cause a stomach pain? Ooh. Well, I hope I don't have another problem. Thank you, real man, for the roses. Thank you, thank you. I am Tiz, thank you. Well, I don't want to take a pill. I don't want to take a pill, guys. Thank you, Lindy. Thank you, Gigi. Okay, so we're just going to assume it's a Charlie horse. <laughs> Why don't I wear glasses to see better? Um, Because they wanted to wait till I finished my surgeries before they go giving me a prescription glasses so that they could see the exact kind I need because it would be kind of pointless to get glasses and like my eyes aren't finished healing and they give me the wrong ones you know but now i have to wait even longer because i gotta get another surgery what the hell excuse me i just had surgery on the 17th and i have to have surgery again tomorrow like i don't know about y'all but I don't like anything going towards my eyeball that's a needle. Do I have frequent headaches? Um, no. I did have a headache yesterday, though, when I was freaking out. But I think that's just because I was freaking out yesterday. <laughs> but I did have a headache yesterday. I'm okay today, as far as that goes. As soon as I know the name of the surgery for my eye. Um, I don't like the anesthesia technique, though. I don't like that they have to put a tube in my throat. That, that just makes me think of ventilator. You know what I'm saying? And my sister passed on a ventilator. Thank you, Anisha. Thank you, thank you. It's like, so as far as ventilators go, if anyone ever says I need to be on a ventilator, I might as well go ahead and say my goodbyes. Because even my mom and my sister, before she passed, were even, they would always, you know, you know, I don't know, for some reason they'd get past these type of things where they would see that most people that have to get hooked up to a ventilator don't make. When they said that my sister needed one, we just <sighs> didn't want to do it. But we had to do it. Thank you, Juice.
I just got a poop. <laughs> You're funny. Ariana, thank you. <laughs> I don't think that's the case. <laughs> Amari, I hope to see you tomorrow. Good night. Your mom's fine, Jade? Oh, well, that's good to hear. Well, I mean, I mean, I'm hoping I never have to... I don't want that ever to be the case. Though, for anybody, you know. My sister, um, she had a rare lung disease. She passed away two months ago. And, um, it was when we finally decided it was a good time to go visit her. We were actually going to postpone it because of me. <sighs> and we went to visit her. And, like, the second day that we got there, she couldn't breathe. And we thought she was having an anxiety attack. But that anxiety attack wasn't an anxiety attack. Mind you, we didn't even know she was sick. Um, we thought she was better because she was sick a long time ago. But we thought she got better. She told us she was better. And um, we were on our way to the park. And she couldn't breathe. Um, so we stopped at a gas station. And luckily, don't know how, but the ambulance came immediately. Um, because we were, like, in the middle of nowhere. I don't know how the hell they found us, but they found us. And... That was the last time I ever saw my sister alive, so... That's another reason that I say that I think the devil is really trying my family. sisters I know my sister is in a better place she's um my sister was a Catholic she's super super <laughs> she's one of those no I'm just kidding but no she's 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 such a good person I know she's I know she's in a good place it's the only thing that keeps me happy I'm like keeps me okay not happy but it keeps me okay What's the business? <laughs> Thank you guys. But you know what? She left three lovely children and they look exactly like her. So I have her in little people form. <laughs> Hi, Anne. Welcome. <laughs> Do I see her kids? No, I, I. they live far away. For me, at least. Um, that's why I'm saving money to move. I get close to them and I can be near my family and I'll be happy. <laughs> my family will be happy. Well, I'll be one. That's my goal. That's my main focus aside from walking and getting healthy my main focus is to be with my family I don't care about anything else um, yes I have her through her babies I um, unfortunately don't have the opportunity to have kids so I got her My mom takes care of me.
Are they mad at me for having AIDS? No. Thank you, Jean. Um, my family only cares about if I'm okay. They don't care about if I have AIDS or HIV or gonorrhea or something. <laughs> they don't care if I had cancer. You know what I'm saying? They just want me to be better and they want me to be okay. If your family loves you, they, you know, they understand. I don't know why they would be mad at me. Something I couldn't control. Thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna get off here in a few minutes, guys. I'm gonna get off here at 11. So I've got nine minutes with me. Do I have any bets? I have a Shih Tzu. Malty Shih Tzu. My, my dog, she's deaf. Her name is Lucy. And I have a cat. Well, my cat's my mom's cat. Her name is Dolly, like Dolly Parton. <laughs> She's a pain, but we have <laughs> that one too. Um, yes, my mom will be moving with me as soon as we can. My mom will be coming with me. My mom has to come with me. You know? Because it's not only my sanity, it's my mom's sanity at this point. <laughs> you know? Think about it. I need my mom. Can't take care of myself. The one which sucks. I wish I could. I'm still trying. Still, that's the goal to get there so she doesn't have to take care of me. And I'll go to take care of her when she gets older. Because that's how it should be. <laughs> she should not still be taking care of me. Um, so, definitely, definitely mama's going. And then I'm trying to get my stepdad. <sighs> he just works a lot. My mom's in the living room. <laughs> HIV and AIDS um, are not necessarily the same. They're they're not the same thing. Everyone thinks they're the same thing. But okay, I guess you could say AIDS is a more extreme version of HIV. It's like progressed into being extreme. <laughs> yeah, I don't know how to exactly explain that, you know. Oh, thanks for sh sharing the live. <laughs> um, once my T cell count is, well, not my T cell, my CD4 count is um over 200, I'll be HIV. detectable right now meaning I cannot transmit it to anyone so there's that <laughs> not that I'm doing anything with anybody anytime soon it's just you know yeah uh, I didn't get not one owl hey guys can I get an owl I need to use a different finger. Okay, we're gonna use this one. I just want one out. I don't know why it has 20. I just want one. <laughs> um, thank you, Carolina. Think better. I don't know. Type in all capital letters, guys. Thomas. No, you can be undetectable and have AIDS. Something about the viral load. <clears throat> it's all about the viral load.
I'm getting off here in uh, five minutes, guys. They said I can't eat after 12, and I got a burrito sitting in there, and I really want to eat it, but at the same time, I think it's going <laughs> to make my tummy hurt. Thank you, Patricia. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the gifts. Thank you. How are you? Hi. Thank you, Jade. Good. How are you? I'm okay. <laughs> Oh, sorry. Where are you right now? I was actually about to get off off here, but you came in with a the live. Nice. Dang, where are you from? Uh, I'm in Tennessee. What about you? Ooh, Houston, Texas. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> uh. Oh, Sorry if I seem a little off. I wasn't planning on facing FaceTiming. <laughs> no, you're fine. You're fine. You look gorgeous. Thank you. Uh, you Sorry if so I'm like sweet. throwing I'm you off. off. I didn't know if you were in my live beforehand or. No, no. I was just going. See, yeah, I've never done just singing. Before. You want her to sing for you real quick? Go for it. All right. Thanks for. Sure. Sure. So, I can move. All right. What are you going to say? Hey. Hey. <laughs> she sing? Do you like like Paramore? We really like Paramore. Sing Paramore. Paramore? Yes. Dakota. Oh, I know. Uh, maybe you probably Okay, we'll sing that one. Of course. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Lucy, relax, mama. Just 
want to hit them high notes it was like not today <laughs> Ow. i wish i could have sang with them but my voice isn't up to par right now <clears throat> i'm on my way to believe it yeah my voice was not it's not up to par right now i wish <laughs> um thanks you guys <clears throat> Oh, my rib. Oh, my rib. They made me happy. 